I just made a video about the top 10 items I regret buying for my twins. And today I'm gonna to tell you the top three must have necessary twin products. If you're preparing for your twins, I'm gonna tell you what my top three are. Before I get started, I just wanna let you know, a little personal, I have reached an all time high in terms of weight for me and like an all time low in terms of like self image and mood and energy and just my overall well being. Had like seven months postpartum, I was just ugh, not feeling good, not really looking good, and I needed a change. So I started a new YouTube channel called Happy Keto, just telling you everything about my weight loss journey and like a my lifestyle transformation that I'm trying to make. So I'm six weeks in. I've already documented my six week weigh in over there. So if you want to go follow along with that journey, I'll put a link up here so that you can hop over to that channel, follow along with, you know, if you're interested in that, my weight loss and my transformation, because that's what it's all about. Like I want to look better and feel better. So yep, it's called Happy Keto. I'll put a link up here, a link in the description if you want to check that out. But today, my top three must have necessary twin items. I am also going to put links to these in the description because I feel 100% confident pointing you in this direction to get these three items. Number one is the Gronzy double bottle warmer. Do not waste your time getting a single bottle warmer. For twins, it is necessary to have a double bottle warmer that consistently warms your bottles reliably and evenly. I'm telling you that the Gronzy bottle warmer does. You can warm two bottles at one time and the setting that I use the reason that I love it so much, it's called normal warming and it can keep your bottles warm for up to 24 hours, both bottles. It just keeps them slow cooking. So what you need to do is once you finish feeding the babies, get your next set of bottles, put them right in. Don't wait immediately when you're done feeding them, take your next bottles, both of them, put them in and put them on normal warming. And I recommend a temperature between 40 degrees and 43 degrees for your bottles. And I tell you every single time the bottles come out warm, I always swirl it around and I always test it just in case. And it's perfect every single time. And we have gone through two single bottle warmers We've gone through using a pot of warm water to warm our bottles and I know how it works. I know how that goes and it's stressful and it's necessary to have a double bottle warmer that works. Grunzy double bottle warmer is uh, where it's at. I promise it, it will change your feeding routine for the better. The second product I recommend you get is the Twin Z pillow. Just get it. Just get it. You can get this second hand. You can get it new, but you will use it. You'll use it to feed your twins, to play with your twins, to do tummy time with your twins. It's a multi-purpose pillow that you will get multiple days, hours, months of use out of. Especially in the early days, the Twin Z pillow comes in handy so much. So don't even give it a second thought. I promise you that if you get the Twin Z pillow, it will not sit in the corner of your room. It's going to be used and you can even use it again, you know, if you have a single tent after your twins because it's a double boppy pillow. So you can get a lot of use out of it with your twins and potential use out of it in the future. I highly recommend the Twin Z pillow. You won't be sorry. You will use it for sure. And then the last recommendation is a brand new nice stroller. The specific one that I recommend is a Contours Comfort Elite because that's what I have experience with and it's wonderful. But do your research on which brands look best for you. There are a lot of nice strollers out there. Talk to other twin moms what works for them. But what I would recommend and what I know a lot of other twin moms recommend is buying it new. You don't want a used secondhand stroller. That's what I did. 
I, I got a secondhand stroller and I thought I was being smart by not spending tons of money on an expensive stroller. But it was a waste, it was not safe, and it it's worth getting a nice expensive one from the beginning. So ours was $400, that's like not the most expensive stroller, double stroller there is out there. You can get nicer and more expensive, but new is my recommendation. Maybe other people have had a different experience and maybe I'm just jaded, but from talking to other moms and from my own experience, a new stroller is something that's necessary. You get a lot of years out of a stroller, and if you invest in a nice one, it'll last you several years. So I highly recommend getting yourself a new stroller. Put it on your registry, have multiple people go in on it if you are able to do that. If you're able to afford it, you know, on your own, great. If not, you know, you'll survive. You can get a secondhand one and it'll be it'll be fine and it'll tide you over in the meantime, but I do recommend in the future. Just like that is something that is a good idea to get new. <laughs> there are things like the twinsy pillow that you can get secondhand and you know, you won't be upset if you get a secondhand twinsy pillow. I do not recommend a secondhand stroller. That's that's just my two cents from my two babies over here. <laughs> anyway, that's all for today. I will be back in my next video whenever that is. <laughs> all right. Bye.